That's a spoder man. You know what makes me the most saddest person in the world? Is that if you get by a cat, you don't get turned into a cat. But if you get bit by a spider, you can turn into a spider? Well, it's... Oh, no. It's because it's radioactive. Oh, yeah. So, if I get bit by a normal spider, I won't turn into a spider. Man. Uh, no, no, no. No. You've got it all wrong, me. See, look, he bit you. Look. His ass. Uh, clearly mutant. Because instead of being the size of a golf ball, it's the size of a people. No, see, I'm I'm still not Spider-Man. I sounded so sad about that. It was hilarious. So I have to No 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 no. If I get bit by a radioactive cat, I'm gonna turn into cat man. And that doesn't mean I'm gonna be a cat man. It means I'm gonna be some guy that's in a cat suit. That's... <laughs> I was all asking myself in my head here. It's like, what does a cat do again? <laughs> I don't know. In the context, okay. Oh, I know. I'd be able to see at night when it's dark. But that's not that special, so we gotta think of something more than that. Uh. I'd have claws, and they'd be pretty sharp and stuff, so that would be a net benefit, having a melee weapon by default, instead of just having my fists and legs and... Oh. So I already have a melee weapon, they're just not as cool as claws. Okay, let's see. I would be able to move very quickly. Now that would be cool. That! Okay, that's a real benefit. Because I'm slow. And... Well, I wouldn't be cute. That's purely subjective. I see a zomber up there. He's hard at work doing zomber, somber things. <laughs> 